Hello and welcome to the King Fahd International Stadium in Saudi Arabia, the home of Race of Champions 2018. And right now, the place where you are watching the first ever EU Race of Champions. I'm Brendan Lee. I'm at the Race of Champions in Riyadh because I won the F1 Esports World Championship and I got invited out to compete in the first ever E-Rock event. E-Rock is a chance for some of the world's greatest simulator racers to race on simulators and then on the same track as the world's greatest drivers. Driving a real car is a different experience. I didn't drive a real car ever until two weeks ago. So it's quite a big thing for me to be able to step in a car and be on it straight away. I believe in myself that I can be the fastest person in a simulator. So I know I can translate that into lap time. All I have to do is stay calm and do my best, and then the results will follow. I'm most excited about um, tomorrow because it's four champions in their own right going head to head. Brendan, of course, it's one of the first times you've ever driven an actual car, but uh, let's go through the judging process. We've given you three on track uh, positioning and awareness, which is a really good score. In car control, we judged him in the way of the handling with the throttle, how he's very, very smooth on the throttle. We're giving him a three. I think it will be very, very easy to improve his pace. We're giving him two now. Two days ago, not driving a car to doing what you've done here today, I take my hat off to you, mate. You've done amazing. Whoever's going to walk away winning the rock event, it won't be unjustified or undeserved. It will be the most deserved winning possible. Bonito in black, Lee in orange, and it's a pretty equal start. Bonito wins in the rock car. But can Brendan make it count on the sim? It's Brendan with the first win on the sim. Race two. Oh no, Brendan spun. It's all over for the Brit. It's Enzo Benito, the victor. Yeah, Enzo did an amazing job, especially on the simulator and real life. So he definitely deserves it and I'm happy for him. I'm not really sure what's to hold in the future. Hopefully it's positive and hopefully my career can continue to elevate itself. And uh, hopefully I get more opportunities like the Race of Champions right now to drive some real cars.